going to start with 20 jumping jacks, two to three minutes light jog or in place. You're gonna do two to three minutes light shuffle. And last but not least, you're going to do that, that those shoulders by doing W's or T's. I hope you enjoyed your class today. Have fun, goodbye. Hi everybody, we're going to do our third week of tennis practices. First, we're going to start with a ball. Any type of ball, you can start playing against a ball. And if you have a partner, all of the activities that we're going to do today, you can do it with a partner, right? So first of all, we're going to bounce the ball against the wall, move our feet, and try to catch the ball in front of our body. We can either bounce it on the floor, you can throw it under your head, and catch it. In different ways, sideways. And even above your head. So make sure that you're throwing the ball always to the same target, moving your feet and catching the ball in front of your in front of your body. Now we're going to do some forehands and backhands with the big size ball. If you have a partner, remember you can do it with your partner. With the palm of your hand, you're going to roll it, tap it, roll it, tap it, roll it, tap it, moving your feet, and always striking the ball in front of your shoe towards the target. If you have a racket at home, you can practice the next activity with your racket. We're going to be backhands and forehands against the wall, but we have to trap the ball before hitting it. This is an example. Hit it, trap. Hit it, trap. With our back hand, hit it, trap. Hit it, trap. Now we're going to try to control the ball while tossing it, all right, upwards. You're gonna start by balancing the ball on the racket first. If you need to practice and walk around. And then you're going to try to bounce the ball upwards as many times as possible. We can also switch and try it downwards. Trap and up. Remember, if you feel confident doing it with a tennis ball, Try it with the tennis ball. Now let's try the pirate catch. In the pirate catch, we're going to balance on one foot when catching the ball. So always play with our partner or with the ball. Our partner can toss the ball and play with us or the ball is going to do that job for us. This is an example. Catch one foot. Catch one foot. We're working on our balancing skills, eye-hand coordination, and on our strokes. Great job, everybody. Don't forget to finish your tennis session playing a mini tennis game with your family members. Always try to play the game the game of tennis. Thank you for coming one more time. Looking forward to seeing you next week.